it true that Junior's having a baby? Yeah, Katie it is. Jay, I can't wait until I'm Auntie Katie. Auntie Katie? I can never be Auntie Katie, because I'm so pro-Katie. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie Katie? Pro Katie? I don't get it. <laughs> Anywho, I think we all agree about how disappointed we are in Junior. You can say that again. Right, what right. a letdown. Mm. There's still a ray of hope. They say every ending is a new beginning. And this is the beginning of what I like to call the Franklin Kyle era. You're still angling for Junior Spot, huh? Angling is such a crude word, Mr. Kyle. It cheapens the purity of my intentions. Which are? Junior out, me in. Well, he makes a point, Jay. Okay, frankly, we'll mull this over. You go play with Katie somewhere, all right? Yeah, somewhere out in the open where we can keep our eye on you. <laughs> You're such a card, Dad. <laughs> What's the matter, my dove? You seem like you've got the blues. Katie, she's my lady. Katie, she's my baby. Problem. What problem could a beautiful seven-year-old girl living in an upper-class suburban community being courted by a suitor as resplendent as moi possibly have? Claire's stepping me for another sister. What do you mean? She signed up to spend all her time mentoring some needy little girl. What about me? I can be needy. I can be needy. I can be needy! There, there, my fragrant mushroom. There's no need to worry. This is great news. It means more time for us. You don't understand, Franklin. What if your sister Rita wanted to trade you in for a new brother? I mean, what would you do? I'd start singing. Happy days are here again. that much, then we're just gonna have to do something to keep it from happening. But how? I don't know yet. But it'll come. You really think this is going to work? Of course it'll work, my love. You make everything work. You make the sun come up. You make the birds sing. You make my heart flutter. Just shut up and give me the number. <laughs> yeah. Now remember, your concerned parent, be assertive. Franklin, be quiet. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> Hello? I mean, <clears throat> hello. <laughs> Is this the big sister organization? <laughs> Just figured I'd come spend some time with my little sister. Finally. Do you want to play a game? Sure. Let's play phone call. Ring, ring, ring. Now pick up yours. Hello, big sister organization. What's that? You have information about your daughter, Claire? She's been in rehab. She's on parole for beating up her little sister? Oh, wow, you must be able to see into the future because I didn't start beating her up until now. I'm sorry. I just don't want you to be anybody else's big sister. Look, Katie, you know how mom and dad have enough love to share with three children? Yeah? Well, I have enough love to share with you and a less fortunate little girl. So don't look at it like you're losing me. Look at it as a chance to make a new friend. Maybe you're right. <laughs> Jeez.
easy. I don't think I'll ever be able to do that. Oh, sure you will. Anywho, you have a doctorate in psychology, don't you? Yeah, two of them are. Well, Jay has started a course in psychology, and she's driving everybody around here crazy. Ooh, classic delusions of grandeur. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. There's nothing worse than an amateur shrink. You know, when my Uncle Thaddeus was in med school, he misdiagnosed me with ADD, OCD, and OPP. <laughs> <laughs> the last one's a joke, remember? Down with OPP, yeah, you know me. Down with OPP, yeah, you, you know, know me. You know my OPP, yeah, you know me. Katie and I are going to ask you a series of questions to see if you're fit to be a father. Bring it on. Number one, what is the human gestation period? About 30 seconds. Well, at least that's how long it was for me. <laughs> how often should you feed the baby? Depends on how big you want it to get. Whoa. <laughs> how often should you change the baby? Whenever you get sick of smelling it. Okay, I've heard enough. So how'd I do? According to the Feldman scale developed at Johns Hopkins, not only shouldn't you have children, you shouldn't have opposable thumbs. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny if you were smart enough to understand it. Does it mean I'd be a bad dad? No, it means you're a functional idiot. Functional years no fucking no year. That's not a good thing. No? No, because the emphasis is on the word idiot. So what should I do? Well, you should pick someone smart and emulate them. Okay, who? Well, I would say me, but let's lower the bar a little bit. How about your dad? Ew! I'm not gonna emulate my dad, that's disgusting. Emulate means to copy. Oh, oh, then I emulated all through high school. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Franklin, just the man I wanted to see. Listen, you told me I should eat for my blood type, right? Then, are nuts good for me? Well, you survived this one. <laughs> but, no. Even though they're a good source of protein, they're still too fattening for someone in training. Okay, coach. Mr. Kyle, you're a lucky man. Your wife is the most dedicated athlete I've ever worked with. Well, thank you, but what qualifies you to train athletes? I have a degree in kinesiology. Oh, what's that? The study of the kines? Ka. Na. <laughs> Mr. Kyle, when are you gonna start your regiment? I'm already on a regiment. I'm on the eat, drink, and be merry plan. That's great if you're training to be fat Albert. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> Come on, look at me, Franklin. I am ready. But, Mr. Kyle, a marathon is a test of endurance. No, it is a test of wills. If you believe in that, you will lose. <laughs> Anywho. My point is, without the right conditioning, you have no chance of beating Mrs. Kyle. That is not true. See, my point is that superior athletes like myself and Michael Jordan are able to go to a place deep within themselves and pull out that warrior spirit which helps them to overcome every obstacle. I'm sorry. My mother won't let me eat this much bologna. <laughs> I'm on fire today. Hey, Tony. Ah, get in, Mr. Kyle. How you doing? Pretty good. What are you guys doing tonight? Oh, we're going to the movies. Really? What you gonna go see? Oh, we're gonna see Bambi. <laughs> You're an odd child. Hey, I thought you said you was going to the movies, not the little house on the prairie. <laughs> Very funny, Dad. What's up with the Bob's Maybelline look? Oh, that's what I was going for. I'm supporting Tony's celibacy. Ah. Uh. Let's go, Tony. Good night, guys. Well, I'm off. Mrs. Kyle? Uh, yeah. Coach, I'll see up? you at 5 a.m. for our morning run. Okay. Mr. Kyle, you're welcome to join us. Oh, fooey. <laughs> I'm gonna lay in my bed, I'm gonna roll over me pancakes, sausages, and I'm still gonna beat you in that race. In crazy land. <laughs> I kill myself. 
You know what? I'm about tired of you. Let's make this interesting. Really? Let's put your money where your mouth is. OK, I'll tell you what. If I win, mm -hmm. then I take you to a restaurant, and you have to eat spaghetti, bread, fish sticks, fudge sticks, anchovy, and chocolate souffle. OK. And if I win, I get anything I want. Deal. Deal. sitting in the car. <laughs> so you ready for this pajama jam already? Yep. It's the anniversary of Mozart beginning the Requiem Mass. Wow, time flies. I just took my decorations down just a month ago. <laughs> so what are you going to do there? Well, first we're going to play Name That Concerto. Oh, party! <laughs> and then I was thinking we'd play a round of What Opera Did That? Aria come from. Oh, you are the wild man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then I thought to wrap up the evening, we'd play a crazy game of Bach, Bach, Beethoven. Sounds like a real shindig, but we need to go over the rules first. Ah, yes, the famous Kyle rules. Let me recite them to you. In fact, I've taken liberty to put them to music. Well, have you? Katie, come on down. Franklin's waiting on you. You need help? No, I've got it. Whoa! <laughs> Are you OK, baby? Are, Are you, you OK? Right? I'm OK. The bag just broke my fall. Are you sure? Positive. I'm fine. Good, because that was funny the <laughs> way you said it. You should have played it like a... Do you need help? I'm fine. I got it myself. <laughs> 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 I need help. I'm you guys run along and have fun. And remember the rules. No staying up past nine. No touching my behind. No kissing in the dark. Very good. <laughs> 